It was at this very moment she knew.
Can you believe this might? It, it died. Okay. On to it. So let me start off by saying hi, Glam Dolls. I hope you guys are having a great day, a great week, a great morning. If you're watching this in the morning, a great afternoon. Let's jump right in. So this piece that I found first, I was kind of excited, super, super excited about. Um, it is a wool-like skirt. It is from Talbot. And I am happy that I found this. I have so many different ways that I want to pair this. Um, it, I'm having some issues right now with the sizing, but we'll work on that. So uh, to be to be determined. The Let's next item actually falls into more of that tonal look that I'm trying to go for. Um, so this is kind of like a cape sweater jacket and it has like the brown faux leather pocket sleeve. Yeah, that you guys see all of that. And I can't wait to pair this. Um, I have so many different ideas for this. I love it. It is great material. It's, it has a good piece of weight on it. So I really like this. So this next piece that I got was um, this green turtleneck bodysuit. Guys, you know I love green, my favorite color. Um, <laughs> and so I was really happy because one of the tonal outfits that I am looking to put together is actually the greens. And so I was super happy to find this one. Do you guys like bodysuits? I like them. And let me tell you why. I like them because I like to wear my shirts inside. And I feel like with bodysuits, I don't have to find somewhere to put the fabric. I don't have a bulge. It just gives me more of a smooth, you know, leaner, you know, you guys know, not leaner, but you know. The so next piece that went along with the green family is this green maxi skirt. I really like this skirt. Only thing that I kind of have a problem with um with this skirt is the high split i mean you know i i'm just not a high split girl um i have no problem with anyone that wears a high split trust me it's just that it just didn't, does not fit into my qualifications at the moment so <laughs> um i i got it instead because i feel like you know i will definitely have, throw some tights on if need be, or I will push it in a sort of way where it is not all the way up my thigh, because um, it's not the look that I'm going for. But yeah, so you guys will see how I paired it up. I think it came out really, really cute. When I tried it on, I thought it was adorable. Next piece that I grabbed was this red Ralph Lauren polo shirt. Um, you guys know I love my basics. And so I just snatched this up just for one. I mean, you know, the material is great quality. I have around for a while. And, you know, this is something that is that I consider a transitional piece, depending on how you wear it. You know, you can either throw this underneath a sweater or put a shirt, long sleeve shirt underneath it. So great find here. Next. And once again, keeping up with that same brand, um, Ralph Lauren brand. I, like I said before, I love that brand. I have pieces from Ralph Lauren that, you know, my parents bought for me back when I was in high school. I didn't say I still can wear it. I just said I have it. Let's make sure that's clear. Um, <laughs> Hey, I'm honest, right? But um, yeah, so this is just a brand that has always been around like my family. And for some odd reason, I have no idea. We, you know, it's just like, yep, we're going to get this because it's going to last long. It's just one of those timeless brands. You guys know what I'm talking about. You have your brands that are just timeless brands that have been in your family. You know it. You guys stick with it. So yeah, this is one of those brands. And <laughs> if my um, late brother, may he rest in peace, was here, he would tell you guys, this is his brand. This is all he wore. I mean, I was like, dude, can we buy something else, anything else? But um, yeah, this is just a brand that really, really sticks close um, to us. So it's more so sentimental is for my family as well as my late brother. So um, it's just a brand that, you know, I love. And, and hey, and sometimes Ralph Lauren items can get really pricey. So if I can thrift it, let's go. <laughs> This and next item that I got is this tummy hair figure crossbody. I cannot take the credit for this. This one actually goes to the OG, my mom. And, you know, she picked this out. You know, her fashion sense is just awesome. I'm forever in her closet. Um, so, yeah, I would definitely be borrowing this. It's a tummy hair figure crossbody bag. 
and it's um, in cream, but it has the blues and the reds in it. So really pretty with that gold buckle with the TH. Cannot wait to pair this with a blazer and some jeans. Like seriously. Another great find by the OG is this green beautiful bucket bag. This is so cute with this gold hardware on it. When I saw this, I was like, what is this? Like, I'm like, I walked that way. I didn't see any of that. And, you know, she quickly let me know it's because, you know, she's the original and my eyes are not like hers. So <laughs> in a graceful manner as always with her. But yeah, guys, this is a beautiful, beautiful bag. I will be like swiper, no swiping in her closet um, to get this one because I just really love this. The gold on this and just the color. And of course, it's green. Hello. So I definitely will be borrowing this sooner than later, actually. <laughs> This next piece, I'm happy that I found. It was over in the jewelry area um, and it is green and blues and kind of gold. And it's kind of like a stretchy, um, like bangle bracelet. This next so once again, we are here. Um, <laughs> a Ralph Lauren polo shirt, basic white tee um, with a blue embroidery with, the, of course, the blue horse. And so I would honestly say, guys, even if it's not Ralph Lauren Polo or anything like that, Banana Republic, any of, any of those brands, even if it's a basic Walmart white tee, I will say get those. Um, the ones that have that good cotton structure, I would say those are staple pieces to put in your closet. You can make an outfit out of that one shirt, whether you're putting it on with a pair of jeans um, and throwing on a blazer or no blazer at all and putting on a regular crossbody and putting on your jeans or putting on some black pants. You can put on your black loafers if you want to go to with that old money vibe. That white shirt is going to be so beneficial when it comes to your um, capsule closet, your minimum closets, your staple pieces. Trust me, that basic white tee can do so, so much. And I'm going to show you guys really soon. So the next item is actually some navy blue pants. Um, and they're just, I, I just thought they were so cute. They're kind of more so like stretch material, but they're kind of sort of slacks. So I really thought these were cute. And you'll see that I have another pair of these. I can't remember what color it was. I believe they were brown. Um, you guys will see later on in this video. Um, and so they are a very good fit. They hold in where they need to hold in. So very happy with this fine. So the, guys, my five-year-old almost wrestled me down for this shirt. She honestly thought it was hers and she was not having it. She got into a whole argument about it and why she felt like the shirt was hers. And I had to explain to her that it was mommy's shirt. And she said, it's a cartoon character. And I said, that doesn't matter. It's my shirt. And, and I just felt the judgment in her voice. And yeah, but <laughs> I'm happy about this. I love this shirt and I'm looking to pair this up with that wool skirt you guys saw earlier. You'll see. You, you'll see the vision. You'll see it. Trust me. Trust me on this one. You got guys, I got these pants because they fit into that color scheme that I was looking for, for the tonal look. If you've seen that trend um, throughout the video, I think you've pretty much got the color that I'm really looking for. So it's although these were not on the list, they made it in the cart. So <laughs> um, I just love the detail on these. I love that heel, that chunky heel with the wood like color. I just love that. So I grabbed these pieces and I'm going to put them up until spring. And then you guys will see them revamp their way through the wardrobe. So this next item is definitely another staple piece. Guys, these staple pieces are what you need in your closet. I kid you not. You can have 10 pieces of clothing. As long as it's these staple pieces, you will have an endless possibility of clothes. So these are these tan flats that I found. I love flat. I don't have this color, so I wanted to get these in my um in my wardrobe and like i said with flats you can do so many things with them you can dress them up you can dress them down you know it's just endless possibilities so i'm so so happy that i found these and they're super comfortable they really are and his hands are the 
um, brown pants similar to the blue pants that I was showing you guys earlier. I'm actually happy that I got these. I'm a little bit upset that I did not get the magenta ones. Um, <laughs> so I just, yeah, why I didn't get them, I have no idea. Um, yeah, yeah, I have no idea. I don't know. I, I, I really don't know. But um, I love these pants. They are actually very comfortable. They are, they're, they're, it's a weird material. It's almost like a Spanx. So it's stretchy but not not too much stretch it holds in of course what it needs to hold in it's like yeah great fine with these okay. have you guys got the colors that i was looking for in this video yet if so drop drop it down in the comments i want to know did you get the tonal looks that i was going for well i mean we we will definitely see it but do you guys kind of get where I was going? So with this next piece, it is more so of a, it's just a basic tank. And you guys will see how I put that together. Um, the next one is the same thing. It's just a basic tank. It's more of a dressy tank. So I was kind of happy to find those. And of course, in that color, um, they, I thought that was, they were very, very pretty. So really, really happy um, with that. Fine. Can't wait to pair these up because I love this color. Okay, right, so we're getting to the last two pieces. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching. I really appreciate it. I love that you love the things that you're seeing. It makes me really, really happy. And I'm just happy to share fashion tips with you and talk about the thrifty world and for my tech girls too, talk about that and motherhood and everything else and just being here on earth and giving another chance to be in front of you guys. I'm so blessed and so thankful. So these next two pieces that I um, picked up was this blue top. It's like blue top. I really, really like it. It was more of a lightweight um top. I thought it was really, really pretty. Um, I can't wait to pair this. And then I also got these light blue pants. They have a wide leg to them. Um, so they are not fitting the way that I want them to fit right now, but we will definitely see because this top is large and um, it can go over it. So, you know, we'll see how we're going to get that to pair the way <laughs> that I need for it to pair so that that vision can be seen. I have a vision. It has to work with me. So, I mean, I guess you guys are saying, yeah, but if it's not your size, it's not going to work with you. Listen, don't judge. This is a no judge channel. We don't judge over here. <laughs> I'm just joking with you guys. So yeah, we'll see. Um, I'll definitely show you guys how I pair that um if it's that those pants or some other ones that will we, that actually fit so we shall see right so Hey dolls, I hope you enjoyed this haul as well as the styling piece 
Thank you again so much for watching and tuning in. Don't forget to drop in the comments. Let me know which one was your favorite one. Are you going to try the tonal trend for this year? You know, I think it may be a good trend also to follow through all the way to like spring. At least I'm thinking of some pinks that I want to do. Um, so yeah, let me know which one was your favorite and, and what do you plan on doing? Are you going to put some tonals in your closet? Yeah, I would love to hear from you guys. But always remember, thrift responsibly. That's, that's the first key, guys. Thrift responsibly. And I also want to tell you that you are a blessing. Remember that. Make sure that when you get up and you start your day that you know that you are a blessing. And if no one ever told you that you're a blessing, download this and play it over and over again because I'm going to let you know that you are indeed a blessing, a wonderful blessing. And guys, I'm just it's so grateful that you decided to tune in. Love each and every one of you guys. Be happy. Be grateful. Love yourself. Love others. Press on. And remember, thrift responsibly. All right, dolls. Love you. Talk to you later. Bye.